put the first hole in our basic cube as you can see in the graphics area go to another extrude to create a hole but there's a slight difference in the way this is achieved this time I'm going to work on this side of the cube so I just left click there rotate the view you notice this time the reference lines if I get the circle tool see it's wanting to go along the top of the cube as well as down the center I also want it to go really if I want it to line up with this line here which represents the sort of the edge of the front datum plane if I hold down the alternate key you notice I can now select that datum plane left click and I've now created a reference line on that uh, plane so I can move to the center of the, where the two reference lines meet left click move out to get the circle that I want left click again center click to cancel the tool double click on the dimension 8 click with the left and a right click select lock to lock the dimension so the only difference really from the last one is I have had to create this extra reference line and that was quite simply a matter of holding down the alternate key hovering over the edge of the, the front datum plane when it highlighted left click and that created the reference line so that's this sketch completed click OK control and D again move it through the model see it's changed its removing material as you can see in the dashboard want it to go all the way through again happy with that click the accept or apply tick 